And she did that because she was trying to motivate me to be something. But those words, she didn't understand those words were crushing me. So I went through a great majority of my life with low self-esteem and feeling that I could never measure up. I felt like I was an outcast. I felt like nobody liked me. I felt like at that time I was overweight. I felt like I was too fat. Then I lost weight. I felt like I was too skinny. People said that I was ugly. Then I had to wear glasses and I, then they started talking about you being four out there. We copied off of Michael Jackson in, in the Jackson 5. You know, if you, some of y'all seen those old movies that you know Michael Jackson, those old photos, he had a big old afro. And the rest of his brother had a big old afro. And I don't know what it was, I don't know why, but I did everything in my power to have a big afro like they did. And I never could get my hair to grow but about like this this much. It was just, <laughs> I was just ashamed. You know, wearing, like I said, wearing glasses, you were four eyes, so they talked about that. So along with everything that my mother was saying, I was getting the other stuff at school. And I walked around, as I said, for many years with low self-esteem. But I want you to know today that if you've been involved in domestic violence or if you uh, know that you are somebody and you know that you have value, then domestic violence does not have to take over your life. It does not have to ruin your life, but you can be something. You can do something. And it looks like you are on your way to doing it right now.